Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi. Hi, how are you? Fine. Almost starting the class. <laughs> and today you are the teachers. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh. I, I try. <laughs> yes, you are the teachers now. You are the ones in charge. <laughs> I am opening all, I have seven, seven things here. Seven? Seven documents. Ah, oh, only seven? Yes, but oh. seven. It, uh, seven is enough because it has a lot of information. Um, if the others haven't sent anything, but they still can talk about what the others have sent. Mm, yeah, okay. We will work with this. Mm -hmm. The idea is that you have to practice English. <clears throat> yes. Uh, um. The, the idea is the lose the shy, no, I don't the, know. the shyness, yes, I and to know. practice and to practice because the more you practice, the better for you. Uh -huh, yes, of course. And um, do you already have your song for next week? We will be singing. Song. Song. Yes, a song. Remember, on Monday I told you. The no, ah, yeah, 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 in yeah, Saturday, yeah. I told, <laughs> yeah, yeah, so I, I, yes, I, I, I look, <laughs> you are looking, okay, yeah, I'm looking the, the song because, um, it has to be I something. Like the Beatles. It, I like the Beatles, but the Beatles is okay, but yeah. it, it, it depends, yes, it depends on the song because some of them has uh, words that that you cannot understand well, but the Beatles is okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, you yeah, may so <laughs> you may look uh, for uh, uh, in YouTube first if there is any uh, beautiful song with the lyrics on it, I, and, and we can we know. can we can follow. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, it's nine o'clock. And I like to start. On time. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Now, I hope that you are ready. Um, is the one that will talk about San Salvador City already here? Ya está la que va a hablar sobre San Salvador? Sí o no? No me escuchan. Hello. Yes, teacher. I am hearing. Ah, ha. Huh. Are you here? Are you ready I... for, to talk about San Salvador? No, I, no, I speak about Trinidad and Tobago. Trinidad and Tobago. Then do you want to start? You are the third one, but you, you may start first. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> then. But first, we will be listening to all the presentations that we have. And after all the presentations, we will be talking 
uh, making comparisons and superlatives <clears throat> about what we uh, listen, okay? Okay. And, and you may ask questions and you may, because we have questions, remember? We have questions and we also have uh, comparatives. You may ask uh, which is uh, largest or which is bigger, which is tallest or whatever, according to the information, okay? And you may also make the comparisons. Um, I guess that, uh, I don't know, Trinidad y Tobago is more interesting than any other of the things that you listen to, okay? Now, uh, we already had six people here. Um, most of the time we are about 16 people. Do you want to, uh, to talk about your things right now or do you prefer uh, that we check uh, because some people is asking me about the uh, some problems in the platform. What do you think? There are eight participants right now. We are half, now nine. Well, let's start. Go ahead. Okay. <clears throat> Republic of Trinidad and Tobago. I know this uh, island for Joe because uh, in Trinidad and Tobago, we have a mall. Mm -hmm. Okay. Republic of Trinidad and Tobago is one of the 13 countries that make us up the makeup insular America, Antilles or Caribbean islands. It is located lo, is it located near to near Venezuela. In the map do in the uh, the first uh, uh, PPT uh, in the map we can see the uh, the location is near to uh, Venezuela. Yes. The 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 principal island because Trinidad to uh, Tobago. Uh, this is one. This is one, and this is yes, another. Yes, and another. Yes, uh -huh. but is um, one country. They, they they are closer to Venezuela than to Trinidad and Tobago itself. If you know, yeah, it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, uh, Venezuela didn't ask uh, uh, that they have because it, it is in their territorial uh, water. Yes, uh, just but, now, uh, be, uh, just now, uh, Trinidad is the the dream for the Venezuelan people because uh, most people. Uh, I read to Trinidad Tobago look, looking job. Looking for a job. Yes, looking because ben, Venezuela is right now uh, on their, you know, uh, some years ago, Venezuela was uh, uh, one of the richest countries in, in South America. Yeah. But since Maduro. Yes, yes. It goes down. Okay. Next, please. Mm -hmm. Uh, no, the second now yeah. is uh, it's a territory made uh, made uh, of two main islands. I islands. Island. Sorry, mm -hmm. main islands. Mm -hmm. Trinidad is which most developed. Um, where is a capital for Spain? And um, next, please. And Tobago, which is which is the most touristic for its beautiful Caribbean beach, beaches. Trinidad Island is larger than uh, Tobago Island. Ha, has an area, area of um, uh, 5,128 square kilometer. kilometer. Mm -hmm. 
Trinidad has many rivers. The most prominent are to Ortoide, which is five kilometers uh, long, and the Caroni, which is a uh, 40, kilom 40 kilometers, kilometers long. Caroni River is longer than Ortoide River. Okay. Uh, this is one of the country with the best per capita income in the region for being rich on oil. They are, they have a, a petroleum, I don't know. Yes, yes. Um, oil is okay. Yes. Petroleum. They have, they, they have many, many, many. Okay. Uh, yes, because Venezuela has a lot of petroleum. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So, and they are very, very near to Venezuela. So, yes, they, they yes. also have the same. It, mm -hmm. it, it could be the same, the same uh, well, okay? It could be the yeah. same um, uh, from the same place that they are taking oil. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, one of the most famous person in this country is the singer Nicki Minaj. She won in Trinidad and Tobago. Okay, uh, thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. Now, I will save it for later because uh, we may need it to compare. Now, who wants to be next? ¿Quién quiere ser después? Uh, which is yours? Is uh, Canada? Canada, okay. Canada. Okay. Can you see it? Okay. Um, hi, everyone. My name is Veronica Flores. My favorite place is Canada. I love it, Canada. Okay, geographical data of Canada. Uh, thank you. Yes. Uh, location. Canada is located in the upper part of North America above the United States. Today, West is border the Pacific Ocean and the East, the Atlantic Ocean. Canada occupies almost half of North America. Size. Canada is the second largest country in the world after Russia. Its territory covers 9.9 .9 million square kilometers. Cost. The country has the largest coastline in the world, 243,000 kilometers. Population. The population of Canada is 36 million, concentrated along the border with the United States. It is a sparsely inhabited country with only four people per square kilometers. Most important city. The largest city in Canada is Toronto. Uh, one city, Toronto, Ontario, population 2,385,421. Two city, Montreal, Quebec, population 1,547,030. Three, three, Vancouver, Columbia Britannica, population 768,032. Four, Ottawa, Ottawa, Ontario, 721,136. Uh, in Canada, you, you can find the Niagara Falls, a very beautiful and touristy place. Niagara Falls are a group of waterfalls waterfall located on the Niagara River. In the north northeastern part of North America in Canada, located about, about 236 meters above sea 
level, their fall is approximately uh, 61 meters. Thank you. Okay. okay, thank you very much. Now, who is next? Uh, which is yours? And New York in California. New York in California. Ah, oh, yours is the one in. You send it. Uh, you are Lily. Yes. No. No. Stephanie. Uh, wait. No, Stephanie. Stephanie. Ah, oh, Stephanie Pozuelo. You are the second one. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. No. Es que eh, creo que se confundieron aquí. Permíteme. El de otra compañera se guardó con tu nombre. El de República Dominicana. Ah. Pero ya lo estamos abriendo. Ok. Ok. Y ya lo había leído yo. No sé qué pasó. Ok. Eh, ¿Se puede ver? No. no. Ah, teacher, sí. de ¿Y Canadá. ahorita? Ah, ahorita sí. Ok. Y yo ya lo había, ya, ya le había quitado esto, pero como lo volví a abrir. Ah, sí. <risa> que no lo puede quitar. ¿Cómo no? Yo sí se lo pude quitar, okay. pero bueno, pues, ajá. Y había ah, hecho algunos cambios, creo. Okay. Bueno, uh -huh. démosle. Ok. And my favorite country is United States, especially New York and California. I would love to travel to those two states. Next, please. California is bigger than New York. Next, please. California is more famous than New York. And New York is more expensive than California. The longest lake in New York is Lake Erie at 9,910 square miles. The longest lake in California is Salton Lake at 8,360 square mile. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Now, uh, who will be next? Me, teacher. Uh, you are? ¿Cuál vas a hacer tú? San Salvador. Ah, San Salvador. San Salvador. I was, I was waiting for you. Okay. Wait. Chair San Salvador, presentación. Desde el principio. Okay. okay. San Salvador City. Eh, remember, one thing is the city and another thing is the department. Okay, it's not the same. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I start. San Salvador, or also call it El Gran San Salvador, due to its dense urban population in the Central America region, is the capital and the larger city in the Republic of El Salvador, and one of the most populated city in Central America. It is one of the 14 departments of El Salvador located in the Central Zone. Its area is 886.15 kilometers. 
and it is population to million seven hundred fifteen thousand six hundred in inhabitants. San Salvador City is more beautiful than Santa Ana City, but Santa Ana is cooler than San Salvador. Cooler. Um, it's cooler. cooler than San Salvador. San Miguel City is hotter than San Salvador City. Usulutan is bigger than San Salvador. Okay. Among the lakes that is as we have the beautiful lake of Lopango. It is a lake of volcanic origin. Origin. It measures 80 times 11 kilometers. Has a surface area of 72. 72 square kilometers and width of 230 meters. It's located in altitude of 400 meters above sea level. 16 kilometers the city of San Salvador between no, among the uh, among Mm. Yes, when when okay, okay. Uh, you when it's between is just two things. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. But uh, since it, there are three, it's among. Okay. 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 Among the Department of San Salvador, Cuscatlan, and La Paz. Okay. It is the largest natural lake in El Salvador. Lopango Lake is bigger than Guijale in Metapan, Santa Ana. Lempa River is the longest river in El Salvador. Tunco Beach is the most beautiful beach in El Salvador. Among the volcanoes, the San Salvador volcano is located in the central area of El Salvador. Its real name is Quetzaltepeque, but people when going there say, Let's go to El Boquerón, which is the opening at the top. Crater. Crater? Crater? Crater. Crater. Mm -hmm. It's covered the municipalities of Quetzaltepeque, San Juan Opico, Colón, and Santa Tecla in the Department of the La, Li La Libertad, and Nejapa in the Department of San Salvador. The volcano of Santa Ana is bigger than San Salvador's. Okay, thank you. Thank you, you. Thank you very oh. much. Okay. Now, who's next? We already have we already have San Salvador, Trinidad and Tobago, and we also had um uh, California and California and um, in New York and we already have Canada. Mexico is left. Okay. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. This is Mexico. Next. Uh huh. Hey, hello. I have come to talk to you about Mexico. It is a country between the United States and Central America, known for beaches in the Pacific and the Gulf of Mexico, and its diverse landscapes of mountain, desert, and jungles. Ancient ruins such as Teotihuacan and the Mayan city of Chichen Itza are this tribute throughout the country as our city from the Spain's colonial era.
Mm -hmm. Okay, Mexico has, has a large community, 20 Indian groups, more than any country in Central America. Some are Nahuas, Mayan, Zapotec, Mixtecs. Acapulco and Cancun are the most famous beaches with a great tourist attraction, which after the pandemic, I will visit. Citatepec Volcano with a 5,610 meters about sea level. The, high, the highest mountain in the country. Okay, I say goodbye, not without first saying that gastronomy is the best. I love it. Good night. Gastronomy. And gastronomy. Okay. Gastronomy. And there is another word here. Wait. Ancient. Ancient, okay. ancient ruins. Repeat. Ancient ruins. Ruins, ancient okay. ruins. Excellent. Okay, okay thank you. Now, there is one that is left, that is here. Uh, is Lily here? Lily Guevara is already here? Yes, teacher. Okay, great. Now, go ahead. Okay. Country that I would like to visit: Japan, Mount Fuji. Fuji, perfect. Okay. I would like to get to now Japan because I think it's one of the best cultures in the world, and among the wonderful tourist attraction that it was is Mount Fuji. It has 3,700, 700, 76 meters of altitude in the highest peak in all of Japan. It is located in central Japan on the main island, Honshu. Island. Surrendered by main island. island. Uh -huh. Honshu, surrendered by the Japanese South Alps to the Northwest and the Pacific Ocean to the Southwest. Sutis. Uh -huh. Look at that, it's beautiful. Okay. And although it is very high mountain, it is just less than half the highest mountain, Everest which has an altitude of 8,840 8, meters. Mm -hmm. uh, 5,064 meters more. Okay, thank you very much. ¿Y qué significa eso que está ahí en, 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 en Japón? <laughs> ahí dice... Arigato gozaimashita, eh, que significa muchas gracias. Oh, thank you very much. Arigato. Ok. Entonces, ya pasamos todos, ya no falta nadie, ¿verdad? De los que mandaron su trabajo. Falta yo, teacher. teacher. Eh, ¿Cuál falta? Me ah, teacher. usted es el del documento de Word. Sí, ya yes, sí. ah, okay, okay. yo, yo hace poco le envié una presentación, la presentación por correo. Ah, permítame. Entonces, eh, después voy a entrar para, para, para buscarla. Ok, ok. okay. okay. Teacher, el mío de Melbourne. Melbourne, permíteme. Uh -huh. Tal vez no lo he descargado. Eh, como no, aquí está, el de Vicky. Uh -huh. Sí, aquí está. Entonces, este, vamos primero con el que ya abre. Se mira, ¿verdad? El de yes. Word. Okay. Yes, teacher. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, what is the largest river in the world? A fixed expedition on scientists is uh, 6,800 km. The length kilometers. of the Amazon. Kilometers. Kilometers. Uh -huh. Of the Amazon, one, 100 kilometers 
longer than the Nile. The Nile or the Amazon between those two rivers that cross Siberia, African countries, the first and from South America, the, se the second uh, navig navigate the debate on which is the longest course in the world. Until now, the Nile occupied the first position followed by the Amazon. However, as the BBC chain publishes on its website, an expedition of scientists has lengthened the length of the Amazon to uh, 6,800 kilometers, uh, 100 kilometers longer than the Nile. The group of scientists on an, on an expedition in Peru, one of the countries that run through the Amazon along with Brazil and Colombia has concluded that the source of the river, it is in a point in the south of Peru, uh, instead of in the north is uh, as have uh, been taught up to now. The scientists travel for uh, 14 days, establish the altitude at about uh, 5,000 okay. 5, 5, meters until now the source of the river has been set in the Apacheta stream next, next to the Snowy Mountain Mismi. The revelation has been used by the Brazilian Institute of Geography and Statistics to affirm that today it could already be considered a fact that Amazon is the longest river in the world. Excellent. We win. Here in America, we have the longest river in the world. Yes. <laughs> se, se ha descubierto recientemente. Uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Thank you. That's, that's uh, a very recent news. Okay. Okay. Thanks, Thank it's... you very much. Now, Thanks. let me see. Um, now Melbourne because it's already here. Okay. Okay. Uh, Melbourne, Victoria, Australia. The city itself is situated in a region of alpine forest. No, as the high country. The city and metropolitan areas of Melbourne also spawn spans along the lower stretches of the Yarra River. Towards eastern Melbourne is the Logging Mountain Range, known as Dandenong Range. Um, 35 kilometers east of the city. Next page. List of the top five mountains in Victoria that you need to climb. Meet Peter Top at 1,922 meters. All it weighs in as the state's second tallest mon mountain. And for those who enjoy a good hill climb, you can ascend this Gian via the 11 kilometers track that we wave up a bungalow. Spur from Harriet B, the base of the mountain. mountain. Look the pictures. Mount mountain. Mountain. Uh -huh. mountain. And uh, climb. To climb. climb. Uh -huh. To okay. climb. 
Next. Okay. The bluff hidden behind the lemon like or smith buller are the rugged natural eh, este, esa, esa MT es, es, una, es una contracción de mount. Entonces ah, mount. lo puedes leer mount. Uh -huh. Mount, ok. Mount buller. Mount buller uh -huh. are the rugged natural ramparts of the bluff which you can ride close to the summit in a four w, w, w t the most rewarding way to visit the mountain is via the 14 esa four, esa 4 wd is four wheel drive o sea son eh, eh, como carros para subir montañas que uh -huh. sean de, 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 de tracción, de, de, de tracción, de tracción. A, tracción en las cuatro ruedas. Uh -huh. Es four wheel drive. Okay. Four wheel drive. Uh -huh. Ok. Uh, track that climb, climbs from uh -huh. the Chipai flat campsite. 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 Uh -huh. Go ahead. Mountain. No, Mount. Mount. Uh, Mount. Mount Howitt. Uh -huh. Mount Howitt is a mountain in Victoria, named in honor of Alfred, Alfred William Howitt, uh, located in the Alpine National Park, approximately 100. Approximately. Approximately 120 no, kilometers. 170. 70 kilometers. Uh -huh. North northeast, north northeast, northeast uh -huh. of Melbourne. A elevation to one thousand seven hundred forty two uh -huh. meters. Prominence five hundred ninety forty ninety four meters. Four meters. Uh -huh. Location. Victoria Australian Mountain Range, Great Dividing Range, Main Range, Great Dividing Range, Great Dividing Range, Dividing Range. Okay. Mount Wow Mount Wow the Great Dividing Divide Divide Dividing Range. Uh -huh. Mount. Bobo has been one of the few places to escape the many recent wildfires that have burned most the Alpine reg region, region. Since, region. region since 2000. Mount Bogong, the tallest mountain in Victoria at 1000. 986 meters. Mm -hmm. Moin Bongon is a mod for all hikers Hiker. out there. Hikers. Hikers, uh -huh. hikers out, there. out there. From the mountain crepe car park, you can take either the stairs, 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 of Ekdal. Mm -hmm. Spur, both are approximately a steep kilometers mm -hmm. from on top of the big summit cairn. You have an unparalleled parallel, mm -hmm. 360 six, 60 degree. 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 Visit degree. Vista. Vista of the high country to take in there are endless place to come. O sea que se, sure. se, se refiere a que usted puede ver a todo alrededor, o sea, 360 uh -huh. grados es que puedes dar toda la vuelta, o sea, solo te uh -huh. va dando vuelta y puedes ver todo el país. Toda la región. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. The short walk from the hut to the impressive Holmes Falls waterfall. Mm -hmm. And look the pictures. Yes, nice pictures. Yes. 
The Twelve Apostles mm -hmm. were formed by erosion, the harsh and extreme weather condition from the southern, southern. ocean gradually. Southern. Southern. Mm -hmm. Ocean gradually, gradually? Gradually. Gradually eroded the south, Limestone to four calves in the cliff, which they become arches that eventually collapsed, leaving rock stuck up to 50 meters, mm -hmm. 160 feet mm -hmm. high. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Now, thank you very much. Um, y vamos a ver el compañero que dice que me acaba de mandarla. Presentación. Vamos a ver. ¿A dónde lo mandaste? ¿Al WhatsApp o, a, o al correo? Al correo. Perfecto. Ah, sí, aquí está. Ahí está, ahí está. Ahí está. Ya lo vimos. Sí, okay. es que cuando, cuando, la, cuando les abrí primero no salía, pero era que no había refrescado la página. Ok. Y ahorita permíteme, ya bajó. Ay, ya lo casi yes. la puedo abrir. Ahí va. Ok. Se está portando bien la computadora, porque hoy en la mañana... Estaba horrible, no me dejaba ver nada. Pero es que acabo de actualizarla. Cada vez que se actualiza que estas cosas, sí. mejor no deberían de actualizarse. Bien. Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, today I'm going to talk about hello. San Miguel City. Yes. It will be much better next year because we will have another mayor there. A mayor that is not taking the, the 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 money only for its own benefits. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh huh. Next teacher, please. Uh, San Miguel is the large in most habitat city in the east of the country, with a population of around two hundred seventy. 5,000 habitants considered by many to the second most important city in El Salvador. Next. Uh, the city is well known for its beaches, volcano in the famous San Miguel Carnival, uh, the largest festival in the country in one of the most important in Latin America. San Miguel City has an area of around uh, 594 kilometers square. Square and kilometers, square kilometers. Square kilometer, okay, okay. Oh. And, and an altitude of uh, 110 meters above sea level. It is located in a valley northeast of ba the Bailey Northeast. Bailey Northeast of the San Miguel Volcano, also known as Chaparrastique. Next. Uh, the Chaparrastique Volcano has height of, of 2,130 meters above sea level. This volcano is among the six months active in El Salvador. It is estimated that it had had uh, 26 eruptions, the last major eruption being on January 30, 13, 20, 13 26. Uh, no, 2016. 2016, sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, next. Uh, San Miguel is also known for these beaches, mainly for Playa El Cuco, uh, which is one of the most beautiful in the country. Yes, I uh, want to be there. I never had been there. <laughs> uh, finish. Okay, thank you very much. Now, see, you have beautiful places to talk about. I'm very impressed with all the jobs that you have done. And congratulations. Now, uh, 
uh, from all the things that we have been saying, uh, you have to talk among all of you. You have to talk uh, wherever you want to talk. Uh, um, For example, you may ask uh, which place is more interesting for you, or you may ask where would you like to go, or uh, which is the bigger lake that we have seen today, or whatever. But you have to, to talk among yourselves, okay? Go ahead. This day is for you to talk. Hello. Uh, for example, teacher, um, San Miguel City is hotter than San Salvador City. Yes, and it's true. Yes, it's true. <laughs> but also the people is warmer. You know, they 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 are very. Um, if you go there and you have no place to stay, uh, there are many people that offer you you may come to my to my house and uh, even if they don't know you okay they they are very 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 nice people they 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 have not only a warm not not only a warm uh, place but a warm heart okay and if you notice, San Salvador and San Miguel has almost the same shape. Mm -hmm. Have you noticed in the in in the map of El Salvador? We have the map here. Uh, when you talk about San Salvador, you oh, show no. a map. Yes, here is the map. Mm -hmm. There. Can you see it? Todos lo ven? Here is San Salvador in red. And this mm -hmm. is San Miguel. Look San at the Miguel. shapes. San Miguel City is it's bigger. Para decir más, ajá, bigger than bigger San Salvador. But it's almost the same shape. Mm -hmm. Okay. If you if you make San Salvador bigger. You have San Miguel there. <laughs> okay. What else? Teacher. What yes. Teacher. Uh, for example, San Salvador is the most crowded city in yes. the country. In the country, that's true. What is the uh, what? What city is the most cold? Chalatenango. Do you know that sometimes the north area because Chalatenango city is hot. Uh, yes, but uh, in Chalatenango we have uh, the Pital. The Pital and the uh -huh. Las Pilas. Uh -huh. uh, there they all they, they they also have a, a kind of snow sometimes when it's very cold in north america we get sometimes like uh, snow in chalatenango yes it's true mm -hmm. i would like to be there when that happens and um, which country do you like most el salvador or guatemala have you ever been to Guatemala? No, teacher. Nunca han ido a Guatemala? No. No, teacher. Mm -hmm. no. And, and you can go to Guatemala only with the DUI. You don't need passport. I don't have money, yeah, I, teacher. I, I, I went to Guatemala. <laughs> I, I need money. <laughs> but you may I go need, to Guatemala in, 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 by bus. 
if you take if you take a bus if you take a bus from 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 Santa Ana, you may go to Guatemala. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> we we have to make an excursion from El Salvador to Guatemala. Mm -hmm. I prefer yeah. Guatemala than Honduras. Even though they say that we used to, uh, Dagoberto said, uh, Dagoberto Gutierrez said that we used to, to make, before, before the war, we used to go to Honduras instead of going to uh, United States to look for a work. Antes íbamos a Honduras buscando trabajo, porque ustedes saben que los hondureños casi no les gusta trabajar la tierra. Y los yes, salvadoreños, y los, y, y los salvadoreños somos bien <risa> trabajadores. Entonces, pasado, este, lo, eh, bueno, la verdad es que nos hicieron araganes, porque cuando, yes. cuando hicieron que toda la gente se fuera para, para el norte. Las remesas. Eh, ajá, entonces la gente aquí ya no trabajó la tierra en El Salvador. Sí, ¿Para qué me voy a fregar si me van a mandar la remesa? Y como justo los que los que labraban la tierra fueron los que se fueron. Yes. ¿Verdad? Porque no, no había, no, pero hoy eso le queremos dar vuelta. Si se han dado cuenta, en El Salvador, we will have uh, uh, better options for agriculture. And in my case, I have made a, a scientist, a, a British Canadian scientist, to make a proposition on fisheries. Uh, that we will be seeing uh, fisheries as a holistic thing. O sea, vamos a ver eh, la, la pesca, pero como una forma holística. Eso significa que no solamente eh, eh, cómo se va a ir a pescar, sino que toda la cadena desde que se pesca hasta que llega a la mesa. Toda la yes, cadena. Teacher. Just now we have a, a fishes farm. It's okay? Ajá. 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 And in in all that uh, because uh, if you notice even in El Salvador uh, lately we have had a change in the waters and we have been seeing some animals that we haven't seen before. You can see whales from the beaches of El Salvador. And, and before you, we, you can not see that. O sea, se pueden ver las, 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 las ballenas. Yes, o sea, so que it, eso significa que ha cambiado, ha cambiado este, las, las corrientes marítimas. Incluso hubieron unos, unos este, leones marinos y, 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 y animales así que han entrado incluso a las playas del Salvador. Eso antes no se miraba. Sí, yes, sí. Yes. Eso uh -huh. significa que podemos tener también más peces. Entonces, pero todo eso se tiene que estudiar. Ok. Now, eh, about uh, New York and Los Angeles. Uh, she said in, in, the, in the presentation that Los Angeles is, is more uh, famous than New York. What do you think about that? ¿Qué piensan sobre eso? Mm. Yo creo, creo que depende de la óptica, eh, que, quién lo diga y de dónde lo digan. Porque si lo preguntan a los europeos, para ellos es más famoso Nueva York. Porque ahí es donde llegaban todos los emigrantes europeos. Pero a mí pensar... Para nosotros, como latinoamericanos, la mayoría de gente agarra para California. Ajá, porque... Uh -huh. More space in New York, teacher. Uh -huh. eh, 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 eso también, eh, que como es más caro Nueva York, y uh -huh. bueno, a mí en lo particular, sinceramente, ni Los Ángeles me gusta. O sea, eh, uh -huh. eh, eh, están demasiado crowded. O sea, a, mí la, a, a mí las ciudades de crowded? llenas no me gustan. Very crowded. 
crowded, o sea, que hay crowded. mucha población, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Es más, en El Salvador, yo vivía en San Salvador, pero en la época en que nosotros empezamos a vivir ahí, nosotros éramos la única casa, solo habían dos casas en toda la colonia. O sea que era más como, eh, era urbano, pero más tirado casi a la, a la, a la, al área rural. Entonces nosotros ahí teníamos árboles de mango, había de, un montón de, 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 de diferente a como está ahora. De, es más, mi, mi, mi colonia cambió cuando, cuando abrieron la, 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 la carretera a, a Comalapa. ¿Verdad? Porque antes era bien sola. Now, eh, congratulations, you have done a very great job. And I'm very proud of all of you. And from the people that didn't present anything, do you have any to comment? Los que no presentaron, eh, eh, porque solo recibimos como ocho trabajos, este, los que no presentaron y están aquí, eh, comenten sobre el trabajo que hicieron sus compañeros. <coughs> Hello. Hello, hello. Hablen, hablen. ¿O no vieron nada? Con confianza. Le da pena. No, pero es que aquí no estamos <risa> regañando a nadie. Si aquí, eh, eh, la idea es que ustedes practiquen. La idea es que ustedes practiquen. Entonces, yeah. entonces entre, entre eh, yo siento que vaya, hay gente que le cuesta, hay gente que trabaja y todo eso, pero eh, yo felicito a la gente que mandó el trabajo, pero la gente que no trabajó también puede hablar. O sea, hablemos sobre lo que, lo que vieron. ¿Qué lugar de les interesó más? Which, which place is more interesting for you? Where would you like to go? What do you like to visit? Uh, teacher, I visit to uh, the, in Toronto uh, uh -huh. two years ago. Canada. Uh -huh. uh, yes, and I love it uh, Niagara Falls because it's an uh -huh. impressive and amazing people, an amazing. Uh -huh. uh, and and, and people. there, Toronto, they only speak English or they also speak French? Uh, speak, speak English. Only English. English. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh, I, I would like to be. I would. I would speaking. like to be in a place where they speak both. Because I I I speak a little French and I would like to to. To practice. Yes, but the, in the north of Canada, in the north part, oh, okay. north area. Yes, mm -hmm. but yeah. in, in Toronto, uh, some people speak uh, Spanish, Portuguese. Um, this city is, is um, cosmopolitan. Cosmopolitan city. It's yes, like like here in Panama, we have we have many people from many parts of the world. Chinese, Japanese, uh, Arabs, uh, Jewish. We have a lot of people from different parts of the world. Yes. And we have Panamanians. <laughs> <laughs> but some people think the Panamanians are lazy. It's okay? Uh, yes. What's your opinion? Yes, but it, the, the, the problem here, I guess, for what I have uh, been here, is that uh, the, the, the law here, o sea, las leyes, are too pampering for Panamanian people. And then they don't uh, uh, see that they have to, 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 to work harder in order to keep a job. O sea, aquí las leyes los, 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 como que los, los, los apapachan demasiado. Entonces ellos creen que no necesitan esforzarse porque los, 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 los apapachan demasiado. Entonces, eh, aunque yo sea mejor 
que 20 gentes aquí, igual yo no consigo trabajo, porque los panameños, o sea, si, si, si voy yo, solo yo, y no, si, si van 20 gentes de otro país y va un solo panameño, aunque no tenga los requisitos, le dan el trabajo al panameño. Aunque uno tenga mejor currículum. Es más, el, para yo conseguir un trabajo, de, 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 un permiso de trabajo aquí, necesito dos mil dólares. ¿De dónde me saco dos mil dólares pero un permiso de trabajo? Sí. O sea, si lo que quiero es trabajar porque no tengo trabajo. Uh -huh. ¿Y quieren que pague un permiso de dos mil dólares para poder trabajar? En El Salvador no son así. Ah, bueno, y todos los trámites que tengo que hacer en, en, en migración, no puedo ir yo sola a migración y representarme y decir, quiero que me dé un permiso para, trabajar, para estar aquí y, y, y hacer mis cosas yo. No, tengo que ir con un abogado y el abogado tiene que ser panameño. <risa> o sea, así están las cosas aquí. Entonces, eh, eh, ellos sienten que no necesitan esforzarse. ¿Verdad? Entonces, con solo ser panameños es suficiente. Entonces, que se frieguen los otros, ¿verdad? Que se friegue la otra gente. Pero yo como soy panameño, no necesito esforzarme. Entonces, siento que es una forma bastante tonta, ¿verdad? Porque eh, es como un monopolio de trabajo. Entonces, este, eh, si usted viviera en un lugar así, ¿para qué se va a esforzar? Yes. ¿verdad? It's the same in Trinidad y Tobago because uh, uh, the people uh, think uh, uh, so long time ago the esclavitud uh, abolished. It's slavery. Slavery, slavery yeah. Uh -huh. Slavery, yeah. Some yes. people think uh, uh, me, my parents... Uh, work hard but why i i don't need uh -huh. work hard uh -huh. yes i guess that it's almost uh, here it's almost like that for example here i cannot uh, wash my clothing in, in in aquí no hay aquí no hay pila para lavar la ropa o sea todos deben de tener lavadora como que fueran estadounidenses. Lavadora y secadora. Mejor, sí, más fácil. Eh, no, Pincha. fíjate que se arruina la ropa. Yo prefiero <risas> lavar a mano. Es más, hoy como con esto el problema de la pandemia, cuando yo vengo de afuera, entro de un solo al baño y ahí mismo me baño, ahí mismo tengo a la par el, 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 el jabón, el detergente, y ahí mismo lavo mi ropa. Porque no me gusta dejar... Eh, para lavar después con todas las ropas, ropa que podría estar con, con, con pandemia, con contaminado. Diga. Teacher, what do you live there? Or what are you doing there? Well, I live here because my brother uh, is here uh, for about 13 years. Uh, and, uh, there, there, there were too many problems in El Salvador with Las Maras. And I was frightened by Maras. And, and my brother, I have three children. And my brother uh, didn't want that anything happened to them. Mm -hmm. okay. Wow. Okay. So he, he took my three children and my mother here. And a year later came. I came. After, after I sold out the house and all that. But it, it, it was something that I had to do quickly. Okay. But things that happen. I love my country. I still love it. And, and, and I miss it a lot. And I think I could never uh, leave my country. But for those, even I pass all the world. And I didn't move from my country. But the Las Maras kicked me out from there. Mm -hmm. Well, it's Please. all for now, my lovely people. Thank okay, you very thank much. You, and mm -hmm. I enjoy a lot uh, being with you. Remember that we have uh, next Thursday the singing time. Please look for your favorite songs. We will be 
Okay, teacher. All of us will sing. O sea, cada canción que presenten me van a presentar con, con la letra de la canción y todos vamos a cantar. Y no me digan, yo no puedo cantar porque dicen que hasta los sapos cantan. Están conocidas para que no nos cueste. Ok, see you. See you next week. Take care, teacher and classmates. Have a nice weekend.